Hey team, I hope you're well. If you don't know who I am, my name is Thomas Lakemore and I teach travel and sometimes triumph. In this video, we're going to travel up to my apartment for a little apartment tour. For context, I'm a teacher here in Dubai and at the moment we are in Jamiria Lakes Tower or JLT as many people call it. You would have recently seen JLT within my recent video where I talked about things to do here in Dubai. So I thought it would be a fantastic opportunity to come and have a little look at my apartment here in the UAE. For a little bit more context, I have an accommodation allowance which allows me to get accommodation out here and be a little bit more flexible. I'm soon going to be moving out, however for now we're going to go quite high up, 40 plus floors up to be specific, so let's jump straight into the apartment tour. Welcome to Dubai Cribs Teacher Edition. This is uh, not staged at all, <laughs> obviously. So welcome to the apartment tour. And this area that you're first greeted with is a bit of a dumping ground for the washing gear, but this is where you'll find the washing machine. And as a result of the door opening this way, you don't actually usually walk past this area, which is quite nice. So it's out the way and forgotten about until you need to do washing. Uh, here is bathroom number two. In one bedroom apartments, you'll find two bathrooms, which is a bit strange in apartments here in the UAE. This is known as a maid's bathroom, although I don't have a maid, but it's quite nice to have a spare bathroom. You're gonna find, I really like the tiling throughout, whether it's on the floor or on the walls, and it's quite large. So as a result, we've got places to store spare towels, extra bits and pieces, and obviously shoe cupboard for things like Ultra Boost, of which, yeah, I've, 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 got, I've got a problem. In addition to that, I also keep my bags so that as I'm uh, about to leave the apartment, I can just grab them and go. Coming through into the main living area, you've got air conditioning, which isn't actually working, which is why you're going to be able to find fans. We've tried to make it as homely as possible with lots of color green, which you're not gonna find here in the UAE very often. This is the TV and TV unit with, of course, Xbox here. And I really like what's going on with this area. You can see the Teach Travel Triumph sign, but also lots of memories and things from around the world. I think this is from another video, Indonesia, and also other things like that, some different photos, and a few books down here. There are more books, but I'm struggling to fit them all into that one section. You're gonna have to excuse that the blinds are closed because of lighting. My last video's lighting was terrible, which is why I've tried to uh, keep the lighting a little bit better in this video. This is a fantastic sofa and pulls out into a sofa bed, which is fantastic for when I've got family coming around. I'm due to be moving out of this apartment soon, which is why it's in the way it is and bits are sort of over the place at the moment. From here then, you'll come through into the open kitchen. You'll see these, these are absolutely fantastic. I sit here very often and as you'll see from the uh, other room in a second, I'll sit here with breakfast and just look out to an unbelievable view, which you'll see in a second. This kitchen is, as I said before, nice and open. All these things are internal. You'll see the 10,000 balloons, which for some reason have never gone down. So we just kept them for uh, 10,000 subscribers. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you do that. Fridge, pretty obvious. One thing I have found strange about this apartment, this is gas. And the gas is pumped in internally through the mains. However, as we're 40 stories up, gas, big skyscraper, in my head doesn't mix well, but anyway. From there, then you're gonna come through into the spare bedroom. This is known as, this is known as the second bedroom. It's also just a bit of a study more than anything. And from here, you will be able to immediately see an absolute insane view. along with a sofa. Decided not to put anything like a TV in this room so we can just sit down and watch the sunrise or just, I don't know, this view is absolutely insane and I absolutely love it. This again is another sofa bed and when we've got guests around, this is another great area. When my family came out recently, I slept on this bed, brother on the other sofa bed and family in the main bedroom, which worked perfectly. And this will be a little bit more familiar, which takes me onto the uh, next section, which is 
a bit of a sponsor slash ad. If you are interested in living here in the UAE and you are a teacher, I recently created a teaching in the UAE guide. I'm gonna link it down below in the video description. And if you wanna check that out, it's going to be in the description. It describes all the different educational landscape over here and the process of how to apply for a job, along with lots of different structured advice on how to support you with that application process and interviews and things like that. So feel free to check that out. It's on my website, teachtraveltriumph.com. And yeah, it's on there. So I could do a separate desk tour. It's quite straightforward. You've seen the monitor. You've seen that in a previous video. I've tried to make this as productive as possible. The globe just looks nice, especially as it's a, a lamp globe. And then obviously I used this area here just to uh, prop up my tripod and all those different bits and pieces. This as well is another separate desk. This was one of the first desks that I had. And as I had the space, decided to keep it here so that I can do a bit of work and look out to this insane view. From there, then we're gonna go through into the master bedroom and main ensuite bathroom as well. If I take you through into the ensuite bathroom, this is a fantastic little space, is what it is. Shower, bath, those sorts of things. Again, beautiful, uh, beautiful tilings and that sort of thing. Uh, and we'll turn that one off, it is what it is. This again is the master bedroom from there. You can see I've tried to match the, the blinds, the curtains, sorry, to the bedding, TV, mirror, all those sorts of things. And again, an absolutely insane view. This is something I really, really like about this apartment is the insane view. However, with no air conditioning, obviously, this room gets hot because it's facing the sun. From there though, I think it's really important to finish where we finished the last apartment tour, which is on the balcony. So follow me and we'll go out to the balcony right now. From here then you can see the view again is absolutely brilliant. I've invested quite heavily in furniture for the outdoor area. So you can see this sort of wicker set and we've got some cushions and things like that for this sort of area. From here then you'll also be able to see that absolutely insane view insane sea view and unfortunately you'll probably be able to hear the building site at the same time which is another reason i can't wait to get out of here sadly i am going to be moving out of this apartment soon but i really have enjoyed living here and hopefully you've enjoyed this video too if you have make sure you hit the like button and if you aren't already make sure you subscribe to the channel if you are interested in living here in the uae or teaching here in the uae then my guide is in the description hopefully i will see you in the next one but until then I'm out.